Let me, Gilad. Blah. Okay, Gilad's opinion is. Hey guys, this is Fitness Still News Dot Com, and here, as always, is TJ. Hey guys, TJ, Fitness Still News, and together with me, as always, is. And also popping up out of nowhere. It's your boy. It's your boy, Roy. Anyway, guys, listen. Cake bites, cake bites, cake bites. So Optimum Nutrition Cake Bites, we reviewed. Actually, we did two sets of reviews. We reviewed the original three flavors that came out, Gilad and myself. Then Roy took, uh, took a video of me reviewing the chocolate glazed donut it was. You remember? And now, and just now, and I'm talking now, as in... As in now, as in, as in currently, <laughs> as in the current time, the Optimum Nutrition released two new flavors. One of them is the blueberry cheesecake, and the second one is mint, mint something, chocolate mint, I guess, right? I mean, where, where does it say the flavor even? It's funky. I don't know where it says the flavor. <laughs> there, no, I found it. I found it. Okay. Chocolate. Mint. Wow! Look at it. They, they literally hide, hide the flavor here, but it's very clear from the picture that it's chocolate mint. Anyway, so if you guys are new to the Optimum Nutrition Cake Bites, you should def first give them a shot. Because it's very different than a regular bar. The, 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 um, the way that they are served is different. It's like three cakes, which I'm going to show you in a second. Um, the, the texture is a bit different than a bar and it's just it's just different so I suggest you give it a shot check out our two other reviews I'm gonna link to them below for the other flavors but we're gonna try these ones now so but what well, as far as nutrition facts 240 calories 230 calories 20 grams of protein 20 grams of protein 24 grams of carbohydrates 25 grams of carbohydrates um, zero fiber, by the way. So these are not fiber bars. I mean, if you saw our Quest Bar reviews or other bars, some of them try to put a lot of fiber to make it less heavy on the carbohydrates, on the straight net carbohydrates. The Optimum Nutrition just put tons of sugar alcohols, basically, okay? So there's only four grams of sugar and six grams of sugars, but there's a lot of sugar alcohol, okay? Not a lot of fiber, which on the stomach, by the way, it's better. Like if you have like three Quest Bars, Man, you're gonna suffer <laughs> in the restrooms. So, six grams of fat. Anyway, just about average, right? Now, we're gonna try both of them. We're gonna start with the chocolate mint. mint. Let's start with the chocolate mint. I'm gonna put this here. And uh, I'm gonna open them up. We're gonna take uh, one cake each. Actually, this is, this is an easy to review for three people because there's three cakes. So guys, if you've never seen the Optimum Nutrition Cake Bites, this is how they look, right? So it's a protein cake, basically, um, which is, and I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna open it up. So this is the texture. Ooh. And this smells minty, okay. Looks like guacamole. Guacamole, <laughs> looks like guacamole. Okay. Before the guys even come uh, come up with what they want to say, I just want to point out. Again, you can see our previous reviews. Even though this is cake bites, it's not soft as a cake. It's more a texture of a bar. It's not a texture of a cake. It's not like you're gonna just. It's just gonna melt in your mouth. It's more like a bar. But the you saw the delivery style, right? The the form factor. It's like three small cakes. It's actually cool. You eat them one by one, and it feels different. Okay, chocolate mint. Gilad. Blah. Okay, Gilad's opinion is. Okay. okay. I don't like right. it. You didn't like it. Roy's opinion is. Well, it. I personally don't like mint, but the mint was definitely not overwhelming in right. this cake bite. Right. So no, it wasn't that bad for me, but still, it wasn't like, you know, something I'd. It's buy not like you would buy. Yeah. So I'm okay usually with mint. Now it's not like I'm a big fan. I agree with Roy. It's not overwhelming. If you're a mint person, I think you're. If you're a mint person, I would suggest you try it, right? I think it's it's not overwhelmingly mint. You feel. I, I actually I have to say I don't feel a lot of the chocolate. Like. Yeah, there's not much there. Hmm. You feel mint with something, not necessarily chocolate, right? There's not a lot of chocolate. 
I would say it's okay. The, the other flavors that I've tried with the Optimum Nutrition Cake Bites were definitely better. But if you like mint and you like the Cake Bites concept, I suggest you give it a yeah. shot. But like Gilad said, blah. 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 Oh yeah. I'm, I'm actually more excited about the blueberry cheesecake. And, and the packaging looks really cool. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Ooh. By the way, this is how it looks like when you take it out of the package. You know, one of the things uh, I felt always with the Optimum Nutrition Cake Bites is like there, it's more rewarding. Like you feel there's more compared to a bar. Like a bar, I feel when I eat it that it finishes really quick. And wow, smells. There, there's there's a smell Ooh. to it for sure. Mm. Okay, so like, blueberry. Smells okay. like the blueberry lollipop. Look at that. Respect it, guys. Respect it. Blueberry lollipop. No. Tastes just like the blueberry lollipop. The dum dum. I like it. Just like it. Yeah, the, like a, I, I never. I I don't know if I know what it is, but you're. Maybe for the, the guys that are watching the video, dum dum. Dum dum. It's the lollipops. Okay, guys. This tastes like a dum dum. A blueberry one. <laughs> a blueberry dum dum. Hmm. Okay. You like? It was good. You lost. <laughs> you lost your cake. Okay. It's fine. Okay. What What do you think? So overall taste. Good. It was like a. Eight point eight. Okay. Texture, good. Mm -hmm. And does it taste like a blueberry cheesecake? I don't really taste the cheesecake. Right, I agree. Yeah, taste the blueberry. Yeah, but no cheesecake. Okay, Roy. So texture. You know, What's your take? Texture. You good, bro? <laughs> <laughs> texture, easy to go down. Very good. Taste, you know, eight point five. I don't think you can really do much with blueberry, honestly, but. I mean, if you if you if they were able to nail down the cheesecake, I think that would be an yes. amazing. Yes. Because the blueberry, I think they nailed down. It, it does taste yeah. like blueberry. It's it's like I agree with you. It's more of a candyish type flavor rather than a cake. But they didn't. There is no cheesecake. Nope. Eight point five. You're saying. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So uh, my take is very similar to the guys. I have not a lot to add to it. I think they didn't nail down the cheesecake. There is definitely blueberry. It is pleasant. Like. I would have another one. Like, I would have no problem having another one. Like, and by the way, definitely compare. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> I think. We're getting better with the bloopers here. <laughs> okay, guys. Show the we, replay. <laughs> we have a man. We have a man down. We have a man down. Um, okay, he survived. Yeah, hold him. Please, please hold him for the sound of this conversation. Okay, guys, so I think compare, like if we would compare both, right, the mint, the chocolate mint and the blueberry cheesecake, then the, the chocolate mint didn't have a lot of chocolate. It had mint. It was sort of okay, but not. I think the blueberry cheesecake is better, even though it doesn't have cheesecake. Compared to the other flavors of Optimum Nutrition Cake Bites that I've, I've had, I don't think these two yeah. fit in the top two. Anyway, like I think the glazed donut or whatever it's called, like the donut one and the red velvet were better as far as the cake bites. Maybe the blueberry cheesecake would uh, compete on the number three or four when it comes to cake bites. Overall, I like the concept. These are also very price effective. Usually you can find a, a box for $19.99 if you compare prices on our site. Or when we hunt down a deal, it can go as low as $15 on an ongoing basis, which is just for $12. 12 of these. What? So that's, uh, and I like the fact, like I said, that you have one by one. I don't know, for some Ooh. reason, it feels like it's lasting longer. Oh, yeah. Yeah. It's last longer. Anyway, listen, people. Yeah! If this video was helpful in your protein bar decision making process, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel to see more reviews like this because this is what we do here. We help you think, not do think. And if you want to save money on anything fitness, you know where to go.